Judges, magistrates, masters, and lawyers filled the streets of Grenada and the Radisson Beach Resort in a colorful procession to mark the Eastern Caribbean Supreme Court's ECSC New Law Year. The world around us is rapidly changing and we must continuously keep our eyes on the future of technology to keep pace with the shifts in what constitutes efficient justice administration. I dare say that one of the greatest advantages of adopting a digitized case management system was most keenly felt during the crisis of the COVID-19 pandemic. Having access to an electronic means of filing and managing cases was truly instrumental in preventing a near certain crippling of the court's services during a time when being in close physical proximity was a danger to us all. Chief Justice Her Ladyship Dame Janice M. Pereira's keynote address focused on the technological advances implemented within the Eastern Caribbean Supreme Court and its overall improvement of the dispensation of justice. Crises also produce opportunities. What courts around the world witnessed and embraced could only be referred to as a court technology revolution. The increased integration of modern technological applications into our day-to-day -day processes has not only made us more efficient, but has also adequately equipped us for effective crisis management. Jurists delivered impassioned speeches endorsing the 2024 theme, Innovation and Justice Reform, the ECSC, Looking to the Future. Among them was St. Lucia Bar Association President, Diana Thomas Hunt. I am also pleased to report, my lady, that we will shortly see some amendments to the disciplinary rules which will finally see those in the profession who have committed serious infractions in their practices warranting suspension or disbarment face tougher measures than the Committee for Discipline of Lawyers can, can impose. My lords, we are holding ourselves accountable, and as part of the reform process, the court has required that we answer to it. Established in 1967, the Eastern Caribbean Supreme Court serves as the superior court of record for the Organization of Eastern Caribbean States and its nine member states and territories. It plays a vital role in upholding the rule of law and delivering justice across the region.